Welcome to Silver Linings and another edition of Tuesday Wig Find of the Week. Today's gray wig find is Suzanne by Renee of Paris from the Alexander Couture Collection in the color Silverstone. Now let's get acquainted with Suzanne right here right now on Silver Linings. So yesterday when I was looking for the wig that I wanted to review today I came across this little gem being reviewed by Patty over at Patty's Pearls. Let's listen in for a moment while Patty talks a little bit about this particular wig. This little darling is in a gray. It's called Silverstone and I just love it. It's a, a little bob, it's, and it's got this nice long bang that you can do about anything. Love Silverstone, love a bob, love a long bang. So far, so good. With. The color Silverstone is a mixture of grays, and uh, the numbers are uh, 56, 51, and 44. I want to stop right there because this is a little bit of a teaching moment. Now, the wig that I have on, I'll give you a little tip. It's 56 F51. If you follow me, you know 56 and 51 combination are two of my absolute favorites. Throw a little bit of white in there. Mm, wish somebody would do that, Jean Reno. But anyway, so let's just take a quick peek. I'm going to get rid of this screen for a moment here. And I want to show you this screen. So you see here how it says Silverstone? Now remember, Patty just said 56, 51, and she's going to get ready to say 44. I can't remember if she said the 44 part yet. yet. But Silverstone with Renee of Paris is silver medium brown blend that transitions to more silver then medium brown, then to silver bangs. Interesting. Let's go back to Patty. 5651 is one of our more popular grays ever. And then the 44 is a little bit darker. So it really does have the gray look of just getting natural gray. You know, you get grayer up in the front and then you stay a little bit darker in the back for a while. She is up. So, are you following me? So she said 56, 51, 44. Now this wig that I have on, as I said, is 56, 51, but there's no 44 in it. So the, the wig that Patty's got in her hand is going to have a little bit more depth of color in the darker family because 44 is in the darker family, but it doesn't say that on the Renee of Paris's website. It doesn't have the breakdown or the percentage of how much 56, how much 51, how much 44, which is maddening to me. But at least we know that there's a blend of three colors. So let's go on. Okay, here we go. She's going to pop it on. I, I love to see her, her before and afters when she pops the wig on. It's got an open cap, and it's got some... Um, See the difference? covering up at the top. It is not smart lace. It is not monotop, but it's full and voluminous, kind of. So you really now see how much darker it is on Pat, Pat that Patty's Silverstone than the Silverstone that I have. Patty's Silverstone has a lot more um, of that number forty-four, that dark dark brown color. I don't have my color ring here right now, but look at the difference. So there you go. There's a little bit of a color comparison for you. So if you want more of the lighter gray with more white in it, don't get anything with the 44. Let's move on. I really don't need that, but oh my, let's see. Five, four fingers. <laughs> oh my. I like that wig. Oh. I like that wig a lot. You know what this is? What? This is your roll out of bed, put this sucker on while you're running down the stairs to the car, and kind of go boop, 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 boop when you're in the car driving and you're ready to go. Her bangs are five and a half, so see they are long, but you can just kind of do anything with them. And the crown here 
is about five, maybe. Okay, so there's going to be some permatease in there. But you're going to need that. You need some lift on a, on a short style like that. 5.1, 4.9, around that area. And then her little mini nape here is 1.5. So you get this poof. I haven't even brushed it. Let's see. Okay, so you, thank you so much, Patty. Thank you for that beautiful review. Can I just say... I love that, that lamp that Patty's got back there with those feathers on it. Now, that's not going to work in my home, but I sure wish that I had a room that I could do that with. And I love, and I love that top that she's got on, too. It's so funny. We, we, we look for wigs, and then we end up digressing with all these things we see in a room or on a person. Okay. So I will, of course, put the specs in there for you and link to Patty's site since, since uh, we visited with her today. Um... I also want to show you, just so that you get another view, um, I found the, um, let's see, the Rene of Paris site, and just a real quick peek inside, just a real quick peek inside the cap. Suzanne is a synthetic wig with a machine-made cap that has adjustable straps in at the neck. Adjustable, adjustable straps. <laughs> Love that accent. Okay, and then one final look um, with a live model and just showing it in a different color. I think sometimes people visit my channel and they don't understand that I only review silver, gray, white wigs, but they do want other colors. So here I found it in, in, in the brown family. Today I'm wearing the Suzanne synthetic wig and the Suzanne is so fun. It's this pretty short stacked bob. Let's do a quick spin so you can see the full style. I love all of the textured layers that it has. It's absolutely gorgeous. And we have some longer pieces in the front and then it's really tapered and sleek in the back. This is a really pretty look. Okay, so we've seen it uh, on Patty. We've seen the cap construction. We've seen it in the brown color. Where can you get this wig? Well, I purchased her today so that I could review her for you probably in a couple of weeks. Um, I purchased her, as I often do, over at Wig Studio One. This is not a sponsored video. Uh, full disclosure, I am a guest reviewer for Wig Studio One, so I am partial to them. Doesn't mean that I always purchase every wig from them, but a lot of times they have wonderful, what they call, flash sales. Now, watch what happens when you go into Wig Studio One and you tell them that you want this wig. Let me give let me show, share my screen with you. And so I found her at this price point of $125.99. And then I said, okay, I'm gonna add her to my cart. And when I added it to my cart, lo and behold, they had a flash sale. Um, and I got her for $88.19. Um, not including shipping. Um, I think it turned out to be about $100 by the time I was finished. So, hey, you know, I'm, I'm happy with that. I will probably review her n not next week, but maybe the week after, soon. Okay, now, now that I've shared all of that, let's move on to what I have on my head. Have you guessed it yet? Well, it is. Without further ado, yes, it's L by Jean Renault in the color 56 F51. There I am up in my original studio. I just moved from my guest room down to my office area. It's I absolutely love L. She is very comfortable and I'll drop the link below 
so that you can see that that video review on L if you haven't seen it. Now, if you wanted to pick up L, you could head over again to um, Wig Studio One, and again, link will be below. And a lot of times I'll go to Wig Studio One, but I'm a consumer just like you, so I will go out and see, hmm, can I get this wig less expensive from a reputable retailer? And sometimes I can find wigs at a lesser price point, sometimes not. A lot of the brand names, you just have to pay what you have to pay. What I'll often do is, especially since I like 56F51, I'll go over to Amazon and I'll just type in the name of the brand, whatever it is that I want. And in this case, I was looking for Jean Renault in 56F51. I used to type in the name of the wig, but I don't do that anymore because sometimes you'll catch a sale. Now, when I typed in Jean Renault 56F51, because I love that color. Remember I told once you find your color, that's half the battle. Then you find your style, and then you're good to go. Like, just good to go. All right, so when I typed that in, all these wigs came up in 56F51. Sometimes they'll do a bundle for you. You can get a comb and some product. You know how Amazon does. So I love that. Now, they did an Amazon did have L. I didn't find any any one that had um, 56F51. You have to look very closely at the colors. But if you're really shopping around and you want to you want to see if you can find a deal, just frequent the pages and see if something pops up. Uh, let's see what I have here. Oh, I also wanted to mention to you, and I have been so wanting to do this. I have a website. Some of you know I have a website. Some of you don't know that I have a website. I have actually neglected my website until I until I retired from my real estate brokerage. Honestly, I just didn't have the time to devote to it, but now I do. So I'm beginning to add wigs that that I wear, that I like, and I will be building out this portion of, of my website. Now, let me show you. I'm going to scroll all the way down. There's the page just for L. You can see it in the URL right up there, Jean Renault Wigs. And scroll, 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 scroll down to the bottom. And you're going to see my YouTube link, my Instagram link, my Amazon link, my, that's my Amazon store, and my Facebook link. Now I will tell you that I really, you it's hard to build out all these sites. It's very time consuming. Most of my energy is put into YouTube and now will be put into my website. Occasionally I'll throw a picture up on on Instagram, but it's mostly YouTube, or will be. It is, but right now it's YouTube and building out my website, and I'm sure I'll add some content to Facebook. Why is that important for you? Because eventually I'm going to start selling some of my wigs. I have so many wigs now, I can't keep them all, and there, some of them I've only used for review. I haven't even worn them. Some of them are gently worn, but all of them are wonderful, great quality rig wigs by brand names that you know and hopefully trust. I am going to create an online store and I will start to add my um, my gently used wigs and my wigs that I've used that I've unboxed only for a review. The funny thing is I've never talked about my social media but I felt that this was a good time to let you know that I do have other social media other than YouTube. So here you ha here I am on Silver Linings. You can come right over here, click these three dots, and then you can like the page. See? Just click on like and you can like the page. And then here is my Instagram site and again, I don't really do too much with Instagram. I'll throw some pictures up there every once in a while. And then, of course, here's my Amazon store. I have all kinds of things in there. I've got wig toppers, all kinds of things about different wigs that I've seen, and wig care. I'll just keep throwing things in my store that I buy or that I use or, or that I recommend.
And here's Patty's Pearl's landing page. I don't know how long that sale will last, that flash sale will last at wig.com, but if you can't find it there, um, you can always come back to Patty's Pearls. So, I think that about covers it today. Remember that I'm going to very soon um, have an e-commerce store for wigs that I like to sell. And I'll always let you know when that happens, which is a good reason to join my Facebook page because I'll promote any new sales that I'm having over here on this page. And so before I say goodbye today, just a quick word. I want you to know how much Ukraine is on my heart, on my mind, in my prayers. Sometimes in the last few days I've even had trouble sleeping just thinking about Ukraine. And um, I'm sure that many, many of you out there join me in feeling the same way. And hopefully all of our prayers will rise up and somehow, some way, these people and Ukraine, the country of Ukraine, will be spared. So I thank you so much for joining me today. I thank you so much for watching. If you like, give it a like, hit the little bell icon, and subscribe. And as always, everyone, look for the silver lining. Look for the silver lining. It's always there.